Now, we live in a very fast-paced world, and expectations for people are much more intense than they used to be. Too much stress can lead to mental issues like high anxiety, burnout, and other stress-related injuries. We now show you in this exclusive report the future of how to treat some of those conditions may already be here. Inside FitRx Gym in Hannibal, these kids are getting good exercise. They're working out their bodies, awesome. good job. but they're also working out their minds. FitRx is part of White Oak Counseling and helps people deal with mental issues like high anxiety, ADHD, and burnout. It's a way to get their minds off some of those stressors in life. I'm getting you out of that emotional part of your brain, the part that might be triggering the fight or flight when we're talking about anxiety. Carrie Danner is a clinical social worker with White Oak Counseling and says her staff also use yoga and meditation in addition to counseling. Meditation is at the core of that, so being able to calm your mind, um, being able to focus on something. Danner says meditation is a hard skill to master because in a matter of minutes, your mind can start wandering to other places that could lead to more stress. That's where some newer technology comes in. That technology is virtual reality and augmented reality. See how it's slowly starting mm -hmm. to darken mm -hmm. a little bit. Meet Sarah Hill, the CEO and chief storyteller of Story Up in Columbia, Missouri. She and her team have developed a VR and AR app called Helium. So these are little portable digital chill pills that are in virtual or augmented reality apps that we're able to use to quiet the mind, uh, increase feelings of positivity, and allow you to see your feelings and to know that they have power. Along with a consumer grade EEG device, Helium lets you see your brain waves. That can act as a cursor of sorts. When you see that your brain waves change or your heart rate speeds up, you can then control your feelings with your breath to get more relaxed. Helium is not meant to be any kind of replacement for cognitive behavioral therapy, uh, which is great, everyone should do that. For, uh, for any kind of psychotropic medication, it's not a replacement for that. Hill says Helium is a self-awareness tool to help you realize and remember what you should think about to soothe yourself. She believes in the not too distant future, people will be prescribed VR and AR pseudicals instead of or in addition to pharmaceuticals. Chad Douglas, KHQA News. A Helium is just one of many apps. For more information on Helium, you can click on this story at KHQA.com. Carrie Danner with White Oak Counseling says there are other free and low-cost apps as well as YouTube channels to help you learn to meditate.